How you doing, everybody? I am Jay Enterprise, and I am joined by my good buddy, professional wrestler, Nikos Rikos. We'll just call him Bill. Mm -hmm. Now, today we are going to try, for the very first time, several flavors of my cookie dealer, it's called. Right. What's, the, what's the story behind this? So, uh, I'm roughly new to it. I've only been ordering from them for maybe less than a year. And ever since I did, I got a bunch of people on the trains because I've been posting them on social media. Um, so it's a couple, I believe, in Brooklyn, if I remember. Uh, Juan Morelli is a bodybuilder. Him and his wife, uh, they started my cookie dealer, which is, uh, at least as of right now, all through social media. So twice a week, they do a cookie drop on Wednesdays and Saturdays um, with that you know current batch that they're making. It's usually some crazy wild flavors. They're half-bound cookies, and their cookies sell out within like minutes. So popular. Yeah, they, their batches drop at 12. And then literally, I've had somebody message me about 12.02 saying they couldn't get their cookies. That's because they were wiped dry. Now, they pretty much make them no order, right? Why don't you tell me something about like you have to order. They only take orders on a certain day and you, then you ship them out. Yeah, day. only Wednesday, Saturday. It's like every week, order. right? Every Wednesday, Saturday you can order. Sometimes they do a surprise batch. Okay. Um, but that's why you got to set like your Instagram notifications because then you can go on their website, put in your order. You got to get 10 minimum, but it's worth it. You freeze them. They come with this cool little box that explains on the inside uh, that you can put them in the oven or um, you know you can microwave them for 30 to 45 seconds. They have little instructions there. So it's a cool box. And we've got uh, four right here, four flavors. Yeah. Now you've never tried these particular ones before. I've only tried what, one. What do we got? So we've got the other one with the wrappers here. I said the blueberry, blueberry crumb cake. That one. Which is gonna be this one. That's, that one. Yes. That one, that's right. This that's is chocolate make-a-wish. This is we go together like, because it's peanut butter and jelly. And then this one is lemon, because they all got creative names. Well, this is lemon crinkle. crinkle. So let's see. Half pound. Cookies. Oh, yeah. I mean, these are these. These are. <laughs> they're heavy. They're like they're one heavy. pound cookies. Yeah. Are these healthy cookies? No. Like healthy. No. Oh, so this is like the bodybuilders creating the cheap. Day mm -hmm. cookie. They make no bones about it. You yeah. do barbell bicep curls yeah. with the. You can work out with them. With yeah. these, do some squats. A absolutely. Put these on a rack. All right. Which one do you want to try first? I'm gonna say chocolate make a wish. What's that? This one. That's that. All right. Isn't there a specific way you're supposed to? Yeah. So on you social do the media, people typically do this, where they break it open so you can see. All the inside. All oh, the innards. All the gooiness and whatnot. The guts. Yep. So. All right, here we go. Now, what's? It looks like birthday cake. It's got like this. Yeah. Colored yeah, sprinkles. I, yeah. A chocolate make a wish. Make a wish. There ah. you go. And now it makes sense. Okay. Mm. I love chocolate. Mhm. Mm They've never made a bad one, and this one just—it's another home run for me. There's a lot of chocolate in there. Mm -hmm. You've got this what, the sprinkle inside? Yeah. Plenty of chocolate chips. Very liberal on the chippage, which I appreciate. This is the kind of cookie you want to have a nice, tall, glass of milk. straight from the refrigerator mm -hmm. glass of milk. Mm. Yeah, I'm very happy with this. I've never had a bad one, but yeah, this is... I just love... They taste homemade, too. That's the thing, is they don't taste like they've been... You know, I don't know, process in a factory. Well, I mean, because you have to order on a certain day and they mm -hmm. ship them, like, on the same day you, every week. You, so these you, are pretty you, much fresh. They are fresh. Yeah. You get them quickly. Mm -hmm. And they, they recommend to freeze them almost immediately. So 30, 45 seconds in the microwave, 8 to 10 minutes on 350 in the oven, and you're good to go. Mm. It's a lot of cooking. This is good. I'm probably going to, I'll be putting these, All right. I'll be trying and putting it aside. I'm moving on. I want to try the blueberry. All right, one, right. What is this called? Oh my god. Uh, blueberry... Blue, blueberry crumb cake. So it's already, um, it's very gooey. Just like completely falling. Oh my god. It's probably a result of the microwaving we just did. Microwave? It's, yeah. it's like, it's just blueberry goodness. So just grab a part of that. <laughs> so, <laughs> essentially, yeah, blue... Alright, so, yeah, do not take this as, oh, this is how the cookie is now. This is... This one probably did not need to be microwaved nearly as long, so this was my screw up. But yeah, you can see it literally is legit melted down. You need like a fork with this. Yeah. But that I love. Oh, that's phenomenal. That's really good. That's got legit from from cake taste. It's like a pie, like a blueberry pie. It does, yeah. With like sugar crumb. 
Yeah, if you've never had this one, for those familiar with it or unfamiliar with it, this does legit taste like what it, you know, what the label says. Whoa! Wow. Mm. So I made the mistake of microwaving all four together. Obviously, this one did not need to go in as long. So it's, don't think of Cookie Dealer as a mess. They're never a mess. This is me. Yeah, I should have done one cookie at a time. Mm -hmm. I put them all in. Doesn't affect the taste, though, it is. No. That's phenomenal. Wow. All right, I'm going to say uh, Lemon Crinkle next. I have no idea what to expect with Lemon Crinkle, but I'm a big lemon fan. So this one looks, not in a bad way, a little more basic. So... It legit, this looks like lemon cake, which, I mean, I love lemon cake. So, I'm not gonna be upset about that if that's what it tastes like. It's powdery, too. I've never seen a cookie dealer. This is the first time ever I've seen one with, like, a powdery outside. I've never tasted one with a powder. They usually all have a, I guess, a basic cookie outside. Mm. Oh, wow. Sometimes basic is all you need. Mm -hmm. So this one's like lemon cake, essentially. Oh. And there's chunks in there, it looks like. Oh yeah. So which ones have you tried before in the past? Oh man. I've tried at least 15 flavors, I think. They they like rotate flavors in and out. One that's coming to me immediately, um, Dunka Teddy is very good. Dunka Teddy is when they have like Teddy Grahams inside. Whoa. Uh, picture like a, if, if like Dunkaroos was a cookie. Um, they've made that, um, they made one with the Zero Bar, which I was a big fan of. I love the Zero Bar. <laughs> I was watching you and Nick Scream do it. <laughs> the one with the Zero Bar is really good. They make one with Milky Way inside, I think. That one was very good. Um, so they, they, they've used, like, candy bars and just, like, broken them down and stuffed them in the mix. Um, uh, I, I have had the basic, like, the OG. For those that don't like craziness, they do have ones like the OG. That's just chocolate chip. So if you go on at any time, that's always there. Um, I just recently tried the hazelnut red velvet. That one would have been here, but I... That sounds amazing. Yeah, that's gone. I ate that last week. So these were the four left from my 10, 10 purchase. My uh, my uh, 10 count, I mean, that I just did. Some more of this blueberry one. Mm. All right, what's uh, last but not least? That one is called We Go Together Like because it's peanut butter and jelly. I've tried this one. I'm a big PB&J guy. Oh, you've had this one? Mm-hmm. I've uh, had this one. All right, then I'm gonna break it open. Oh yeah, no, break it open. Just uh, uh, oh look at that. See, that's the uh, the jelly and the. Looks peanut like butter. legit peanut butter and jelly. Have some nice creamy, rich, heavy peanut butter. Yeah. As the last yeah. one. I love this one. I wasn't expecting jelly to be in there. No, uh, it'll all the way. I thought it was just gonna be like a peanut butter cookie, but then like went all out into mm -hmm. peanut butter and jelly. It's legit. Cookie. Yeah. Wow. Mm. Literally oozing. Think of like if an uncrustable like really went the distance with itself and it wasn't just a basic, you know, patty. Like this is legit. You just mashed peanut butter and jelly in some dough. Like this is this is the result. It literally is like goober grape. It like stuffed inside. And I mean that in a good way. Mm. All right, so my burning question, because I've had Cookie Dealer, I've probably tried at least 12 flavors. No, definitely more. <laughs> I've probably tried 20 flavors of Cookie Dealer by now. Um, between me ordering and friends and family, and we've swapped, like my sister buys a lot. But you've never had Cookie Dealer. So what do, what do you think of your sampling today? I knew what to expect regardless. I knew these were going to be bangers, but what, what do you think? I think they're all excellent. I'm looking forward to... Uh trying some more out um, and that website is it just my cookie dealer my cookie dealer you gotta go on Instagram uh. because if you follow at my cookie dealer they will post what the batch for that week is gonna be so you know like it's not always the same batch all the time okay. so and sometimes I'll do a surprise drop it'll be like Sunday, one o'clock, and you're like, uh, and like they're posting like and it's all like limited availability, right? Limited. Wow. Well, I mean, 
this, these four that I, all four of these were fantastic. I am looking forward to trying some more. If any of you out there have tried my cookie dealer, let me know down below in the comments what are your favorite ones, which ones do you recommend, because obviously you say there's a lot of flavors out there. Which ones do you recommend for me to try next? Let me know down below. If you're entertained by this video, please show your support by liking, sharing my mouth. I'm like, I've got like so much saliva in my mouth from these cookies, I can't, I'm like slurring. Yeah. Like, share, subscribe. Which one do you like the best out of all four? Honestly, it's probably a toss up between the lemon and the blueberry. The lemon was surprising. Like, I, I didn't expect to like that one as much as I did.